Good evening, Los Santos, and welcome to Weasel News. What do you get when you put two dogs and two folks dressed up in Western wear? I'll tell you what you get. A robbery. Coming up next on Weasel News. Hello everybody, my name is Chris Gray and tonight's episode we're going to talk about a robbery that happened here at this LTD off of North Rockford Drive where when I came in uh, it was definitely an interesting sight of who our suspects were. Uh, we had two with some dog masks on and then we also had two looking like cowboys and cowgirls. We're going to go ahead and show you what happened at this robbery. Hello everybody, this is Chris Gray with Weasel News where we are outside the LTD station here at North Rockford Drive as you leave in the city limits of Los Santos as uh, we do have a hostage situation going on inside uh, the LTD here. Uh, it looks like we have two people uh, with some type of like purple doggy masks. Uh, as well as it looks like uh, we do have uh, what looks to be a female over here and uh, sunglasses in a pink hat with a gun. We do have uh, law enforcement here on the scene of what's going on here inside this LTD uh, off of North Rockford Drive. All right, it looks like they are now coming out of the LTD here. Uh... It looks like what we do have, as I said, uh, uh, we do have the, the, the doggies and, and a couple of cowboys. It seems like cowboys and cowgirls. Uh, it looks like uh, the gentleman over there must have been their hostage as they are now fleeing the scene with the law enforcement on tow here from the LTD in North Rockford. Oh, and there was another car that just kind of went by me here. That was them as they went around the circle. As you can see, they did take off from the robbery and from the word I heard, they did get away and are still at large. However, I did get a interview with the hostage of the situation who also would like to share information of a new place here in town for you guys to check out. We're going to go to that right now. This is Chris Gray. We're still outside the LTD here at North Rockford, where we do have the hostage in this situation. Sir, can you tell us what it was like there in the store? Well, they were actually really nice people. They were, um, they had doge masks on. Uh, the one guy started barking at the officers, but he was really nice. Um, yeah, they took care of me. They, uh, fed him ward. Um, no complaints, honestly, other than me trying to sell some zoo tickets. And you know, it took me from the zoo. So, so, so you were at the the zoo, and uh, these four individuals come and grabbed you from the zoo to bring you to the station to rob. Well, I was actually down next to Hayes getting my car repair, uh, hanging out with some friends. But I was actually trying to sell the tickets inside Hayes. You know, what I mean? trying to make trying to make up money. Really broke right now. Definitely understand. Uh, so, but they treated you fair as far as th the way they treated you while you're in the store. Yeah, they did. They took care of me. They, uh, oh were really God, nice. Oh my God, am I going to be on the news? Do what you need. Get in the camera. There is a live. This is live. So, it? do you have anything you'd like to say to anybody if they were caught in some situation like this? Um, honestly, the best thing to do is just keep yourself calm. Uh, y'all, big Janaid in the building. <laughs> already know who it is. Yeah, so you just said, gotta keep yourself calm and just you know go with this go with the fool they're not there to hurt you if anything so as long as you keep yourself calm you're you do pretty good yeah usually they, they, you usually want to get out of there so they won't try and affect your life or bother you you know usually they're mostly nice you education asshole but that's it all right well you were mentioning selling zoo tickets i will give you an opportunity to tell the viewers at, at home a little bit about the zoo that you're talking about Okay, so uh, the zoo just opened up, up in a uh, grape seed. Um, the postal code, hold on, let me get it for you. The zoo um, is absolutely incredible. I just went there. 
Yeah, the, the zoo is really nice for uh, if you get in a bad situation with your wife or maybe like your girlfriend. You know, you take her up there, you you show her around the zoo, you're in the good books, you know what? Um, I'm struggling to find the postal code for the zoo. I had it a minute ago. Uh, 2025. It's, it's very big, you're, it's very hard not to miss. Um, yeah. Awesome, so you're basically saying if anybody wants to have a little bit of a good time, maybe, you know, cool the fires of a fight, uh, the zoo might be a good place to go, huh? Oh yeah, for sure. Um, it's very Most cheap definitely. and affordable. Uh, you know, it's just a good time to... You, you get the whole ticket for the day so you can, you know, go back with your lady and, you know, when the zoo's a little quieter and have the zoo to yourself. Well, that's good. All right, all the viewers at home, as you see, uh, he is safe from the robbery here. He tells you to make sure that you just uh, listen to what they say and you'll be all right during the situation. And uh, make sure that you go check out the zoo. Hi, Mom. I made it. I'm famous. This is Chris Gray with Weasel News. We are glad that he was all right and was able to escape out of there. And take his word for it. Check out the new place that's up there in Grapeseed for a good time. My name is Chris Gray. Thank you for tuning in to Weasel News and have a wonderful day.